No capes, no skips. Hey y'all, what's up? Good morning. Today is Wednesday. A very beautiful, oh so pretty Wednesday. <laughs> September 25th. And for those of y'all who don't know, it's my birthday. So, that being said, we just came back from doing a little birthday shopping. Broke my nail today. This one feels like it's also finna break, so we gotta fix our nails today too. Don't ignore, you know, just ignore how I look. We're gonna be transforming really soon, really soon. But, I wanted to get into this haul with y'all. So, the first thing that we got is a, not the wig hanging up back there, girl. <laughs> That's the wig I'm wearing for my birthday. Anyway, so the first thing we got is a new curling wand. This is a ceramic tool with ceramic iron because I just feel like the the irons that I have right now, they're, I believe, titanium or something like that. Not titanium. Girl, I don't know. Either way, I feel like since the T3 is a ceramic curler, I feel like that's why it does so well with holding the curls. And my curls have not been holding lately. Not with that uh, curl iron. So I got another one that's ceramic. And we're going to try this out and see if it works. It's a one and one fourth inch. Let me open it up. Y'all can kind of see it right here. This is what it looks like. I was expecting a longer barrel. But I mean, I guess we can't uh, really. Vegas can't be choosers, you know. So this is what we got. Eventually, I'm going to get a T3, but I'm just trying to make sure that it's worth it, you know, and that I'm not only buying it because that's the popular curl that I am. So if this one doesn't work to my standard of what I'm trying to get it to work to, we'll go ahead and get a T3. But we got to get a, a new lens before we do that. So we'll finish off with everything that we got from Ulta. I got another one of these Real Techniques um, foundation brushes. This is called the Expert Face Brush. It's a dense, dim, a dense dome shaped brush. Um, yeah, I got this for my new foundation, which I'm gonna show y'all in just a second. And then I also got a new blush. This is the Juvia's Place blush. I also wanted to get this when it first came out, but I, I'm I'm one of the people that likes to wait to make sure that the hype is real and. The way the girls be eating this blush up, I'm like, oh, please. I need it. I got it in the color Pink Lady. This is what she looks like. So cute. So pretty. I cannot wait. I've learned that I do lean more towards pink blushes in the fall and the winter versus in the summer. I'm an orange blush girl. So I got that for the upcoming months. And then I had to re-up on my La Roche-Posé. I told y'all I was looking for another cleanser. I was gonna do the YouTube to the people, but you just can't go wrong with this. Somebody, I've seen somebody else post it. Oh, it's my best friend. One of them, but they posted this and they was like, ain't nothing really doing it like this. And I was like, you're right, because I have been there. So I'm gonna use La Roche. I need to go ahead and invest in, more, in some more Panox, but I can't believe I forgot to pick that up. Dang it. Um, anyway, so got that. And then I got a new blush. This is the Volume 4 blush, again, to go along with the pink. I think right now I use Volume 5, Volume 3 or Volume 5. And uh, it's like a burgundy and an orange in it. And so I got the Volume 4. I'm trying to open it, y'all. This is what the blush looks like. It's more pinky. I don't know. I feel... Oh. Y'all, I have been in such a girly, just glitzy, glammy mood, and I kind of like it. I don't know. I don't know where it came from, but I love it. So this is the blush, or this is what it looks like. It's like a really hot pink and then a light pink. And I want to use these for um my blush, like my new blush. So cute! So cute! Ah! so cute okay the last thing that i got from uh ulta was this l'oreal voluminous mascara it's in the color what is this 
it's a waterproof mascara carbon black yeah it's waterproof carbon black i got this because i always use my brown like liner not brown liner my brown mascara and i just wanted a black one for like a you know a deeper darker type of fit you know so i got this one everybody aside from the was it Too Faced I forgot what it's called, but it's by Too Faced and it's like a intense black. It's so pretty. I do want to try that one, but I don't know, girl. They said don't, you can, there's some things that you can be cheap about and there's some things that you shouldn't. And one of the things that you could be cheap about is your mascara. So that's why I went ahead and was cheap about it. You know, you know, we had to stop by Sephora. Oh, I'm so, uh, this one I'm excited about. Okay. So this one I did fall into the hype. I fell into the hype because I tried it in the store and we color matched me and everything and girl the way that this foundation sat on my skin number one but number two I also seen one of my mutuals using it on TikTok and girl her skin looks so 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 good so I went ahead and got it ah, the Patrick Ta foundation I'm in the shade 20 golden. Ugh. This stuff and 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 I cannot I cannot wait to play in my face. I cannot wait to play in my face. This first of all, the packaging, can we get into the packaging? So good. It's like heavyweight. It's so pretty. So I was going in there originally to try out the NARS foundation. So there's that. And then I also picked up, oh, <laughs> I also picked up the Vanish um, concealer by Hourglass. Uh, I have been eyeing this concealer for so long, for so long. Y'all, I feel so good, like just to be able to upgrade my makeup ugh, to some better products, some good products that I know is going to work. Ugh. I got this one in the color Maple. So pretty. So pretty. It has a beautiful finish. It's creamy. It's not as thick as the, um, the Too Faced that I use, which I'm excited about because the lady in Sephora was like, yeah, the Too Faced is a bit drying. And she was like, this one, yeah. And I was like, oh, because I have been having problems with my concealers and I just don't understand. So we got some new concealer. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. I'm so happy. And then she was like, these two together, those two. And then of course, it's my birthday. It's my party and I'll cry if I want to. And so I got <laughs> I got the youth to the people skincare um birthday gift. It comes with the moisturizer, a glow mask, and a little travel size of the cleanser, the super food, super food cleanser. So that's good. I can put these in my travel bag because we will be traveling a lot more soon. And then I also got a tester of the NARS foundation. Now I did get it in the color Macau. This one looked good, but she was like, just test it out and see how you like it. So she gave me a tester, which I'm so grateful for. Also, did y'all know that Sephora did like facial treatments? Like they do facials in Sephora. That's crazy. So yeah, that is my mini birthday haul. I'm so excited to try everything out. Tonight I'm having like a little, a little gathering, let's say that, with just a few people that um, I love, my favorite people in the world. And then probably this weekend we're going to do something with like the rest of my friends and family. But yeah, I'm not going to be recording tonight, so I think I'm going to do some work because I have to re-edit a little bit for this one hair company which I don't know if I'm gonna be working with them like that no more. I don't have to do anything today because it's my birthday and if I don't wanna do anything, I don't have to do anything. I don't know if it's just me, but the birthday, the birthday gifts ain't birthday gifting like from these uh, companies like they used to. 
Like they used to be like, here's a full free meal or here's, <laughs> here's a, a free uh, accessory or something like that. Now they being stingy. They talking about 20% off. 20? It's my birthday. Talk to y'all later. Hey y'all, what's up? Welcome and welcome back to my channel. My name is Adrienne if you're new and if you're not new, welcome back to another mother vlog. It's officially Vlogtober! It's Vlogtober. I didn't tell y'all I was doing this, but I am doing Vlogtober. I am committing myself to it. This is gonna be a bunch of healthier vlogs because y'all are just gonna be going on this journey with me. So, um, yeah, oh, also had a great birthday. I didn't record anything for my birthday. Excellent birthday, excellent birthday weekend. It's been excellent, just 28, you know? Um, it is currently Saturday, it's the 28th. <laughs> She's 28, it's the 28th. Anyway, uh, it's Saturday the 28th and it's gonna be six o'clock. I have not ate anything all day. I literally went to the gym earlier. I went to the gym in like one or two went to the gym today's workout was a little bit harder to get through even though like i didn't do anything very strenuous like i did my regular workout but it was a little bit harder to get through um but we got through it nonetheless it was probably because i didn't want to be there like i really just didn't want to go to the gym um but we did and i'm proud of myself so after the gym we went to sam's and we went to target i'm gonna show you everything we got Pretty much everything is like protein based or like, you know, to uh, I told y'all I've been trying to up my protein and stuff like that. So everything is to up that for me, you know? So of course we're starting off strong with my elite core powers. These are the 42 grams of protein ones. I figure I need as much protein as possible. My goal is to have 114 grams of protein. I don't know all that. 114 grams of protein every day so 42 grams and then i got these and i know people have their opinions about these but i like them and i saw they had a new flavor which pumpkin spice come on so i got the pumpkin spice ones. these are premier proteins by the way and these have 30 grams so i was going to get the atkins um meal replacements but those only have 15 grams of protein in them and i'm realizing that i don't eat very much but i drink a lot of things like i i love a drink you know so i figured i would like up my protein by all of my drinks we have more protein stuff coming in tomorrow or monday and we have a whole nother like supplement haul like all that good stuff coming in but this is just what i got today speaking of supplements where are my probiotics where y'all at I ordered some uh, probiotics on Amazon and they said they was going to get delivered between the hours of 2 and 4. Oh, it says delivered. Where, where were you delivered? Left at the front door. They got a picture at the front door, so we're going to go check that out. Actually, let me go do that right now so I can share that with y'all too. All right. The pack has been secured. Okay. So... Yeah, we got the premier protein, we got the core powers, and then we went to Target, and we did a few little pickups there. I want to make a Sleepy Girl mocktail tonight because I have been literally, I haven't been having very much good sleep lately. So I got an Olipop for that. I'm going to use that and my Nello, um, what is it called, calming powder, something like that. Use those together, and then... I got some matcha so that I can make matcha tea. Like, what's it called? Matcha lattes with the pumpkin spice. Because y'all know, if y'all know, y'all know. <sighs> I haven't been to, I haven't been to Starbucks. I haven't been to Starbucks ever since we stopped messing with Starbucks, you know? So I'm, I'm hoping the goal is for this to taste like my, uh, my go-to fall Starbucks matcha. And I have really, 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 really been craving matcha lately. So I just got a thing of matcha. Um, we got some of these tuna creation packets for me to snack on. I'm a snacker. 
as well. I'm a drinker and a snacker. Well, not liquor, but you know what I mean. Um, so I got these tuna creation packets. I got two of the Buffalo Hots, one of the Jalapeno. She's a spicy girl. And then also two of the Thai chilies. These are my favorite ones that I've found so far, but I've never tried the Buffalo and I haven't tried the Jalapeno. Um, I was a little upset because only the Buffalo, okay, slow down. Only the Buffalo has 15 grams of protein, but everybody else has 14 grams. So I'm like, I don't know what that's about, but that's what we got these for. And I don't really know what I'm gonna use to like eat these with. I know for sure I could put them over some rice or something, but like, am I gonna want that every day? Mm, I could probably do like a wrap or something, a salad, something like that. So we got those. And then y'all know, y'all know, y'all know. I had to go and get some of my little drinks. These are the ice drinks. I got another fruit punch because y'all know this is my favorite one. Fun fact, this one actually has five calories in it. When that happened? They supposed to be calorie, zero, zero calorie. I, I don't know where five came from. Anyway, and then I saw this flavor. It's strawberry lemonade and I love, love strawberry lemonade. So I got that one. And then this one also has five calories. So that's what we got from Target and Sam's. I haven't eaten a thing, by the way. I just want y'all to know that. I am literally running on fumes. Mm -hmm. These are my probiotics that I got. Let me get uh, something to open this up with. So I finished my Black Girl Vitamins. Y'all know I like those. But who was I watching? I was watching Alyssa on TikTok. And she was talking about these probiotics and how like they make her feel and it's a prebiotic and a probiotic in one capsule and i have been looking into pro pre and probiotics um a lot lately especially since i don't like yogurt at all um yeah i'm not suffering through no more yogurt sessions you know so when i saw these i was like okay they're a little pricey She's, she's a cute penny, <laughs> okay. She's a cute penny. So we're gonna, we're gonna, you know, take them and see how we feel. There are 60 day supply, so that's kind of how I, I rationalize the price in my head. Because I'm like, okay, I'm not paying for just one month of probiotics, I'm paying for two months of probiotics. I'm like, okay, might as well, you know? And so, these are the ones we got. They packaged them really nicely, I will say that. Here are the probiotics I'm gonna be using. These are the seed probiotics. They have a prebiotic capsule on the outside and then a probiotic capsule on the inside. So, I mean, so far, the packaging is not disappointing me. <laughs> The packaging is not disappointing me. I mean, it's cute. She's cute. But let's just pray that she works. So this is what the bottle looks like. Oh, it's glass. Read before you see, period. Okay. We're going to get into that, but I'm going uh, to um, be taking these and I'll let y'all know how I feel at the end of the month. Oh, speaking of at the end of the month, girl, let me, let me heat up my food because... I'm gonna get lightheaded. <laughs> I'm about to pass out. I think I wanna scramble me up an egg real quick and put it in there because I need like extra. All right, so while the eggs are over easing, I'm just gonna um, put all this stuff away. But I was also gonna tell y'all about my Rhodiola Rosea experience. 10 out of 10, would absolutely recommend. If you have never tried it, or if you're looking for something like lower your cortisol, le cortisol levels, or like your stress levels, or just to mellow and balance you out, Rhodiola. I repurchased some Rhodiola. And then I also picked up something else. I think I'm gonna get turmeric next too. So that's like my 
vitamin vitamin we're gonna be drinking this um with our ground beef and rice i don't know if i told y'all what i made i pre uh what well not pre was called meal prep some ground beef and rice last week and i'm on my last two little bowls of it so that's what i put in there i have suya um seasoning on top suya spice on top and then i have cayenne on top as well because the suya spice that i bought wasn't really spicy so i got that we're gonna put this anything else i think that's it oh child let me get the get the pick get the pick so we can eat get the pick oh i don't know why i always use this pan when i know it's not none stick child everything just be not a drop of piece of egg everything be sticky i don't like that oh okay all right oh okay all right here's our food it didn't turn out pretty it's fine it's fine it's gonna get ate regardless regardless but you know one thing that i find this smells good i just smelled it one thing that i find um what am i trying to say like i find it easy i'm glad grateful <laughs> that this whole journey has taught me that food does not have to be complicated it don't gotta be complicated at all like Oh, everything could all be so simple. Meat, veggie, starch. Meat, veggie, starch. That's it. Oh. <clears throat> I brought out the red wine vinegar just to see what it's hidden for. I don't want too much because what if it's nasty? Oh, just right there. Oh, God, thank you. <laughs> it's not bad, but way too strong. Way too strong for a very simple meal. What do I be thinking? I don't know, but I'm glad I ain't put it on the whole thing. <laughs> <clears throat> this is the longest I've gone without eating since i started this honestly like after that first week i was like uh-uh <laughs> i need to eat i don't know what happened today i don't ever want to have ground beef that's not taco ground beef without sweet spice best investment <clears throat> that i've made wow and then the over easy egg it's so buttery. The reason I'm so inspired to get my protein up <clears throat> is because I didn't realize how much protein I was actually getting in a day. Um, everybody says that like not getting enough protein can also slow your progress, you know? So I've been trying to like get my protein in and I realized, girl, <laughs> What protein? Where has the protein been? I've been eating like maybe, maybe 50 grams of protein. And I need 114. <laughs> 114. So that means I have to up my ground beef or up my chicken and um, reduce my rice. I only eat a half cup of rice, which is not bad. It's only 120 calories. But since I'm adding more calories to the ground beef, I'm gonna just reduce the calories in the starch. And that will double the protein. <laughs> so if this meal was one full cup of ground beef, it would be 58 grams. <sighs> so yeah, we're gonna do that. Oh, I'll also be tracking. I, I, I. Completely forgot. I can eat a whole hog right now. Probably not a hog, but 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 I can for sure still eat. All right. So this meal in total was 429 calories. I have 1,200 calories left for the day, and it's 6:30. <laughs> oh, I'm through. <laughs>
This is the strawberry lemonade. It has a weird aftertaste. I don't know how I feel about that. Okay, so the meal that I just ate, even though it was, even though it was only 429 calories, it was 38.8 grams of protein, which is not bad. Not bad at all. Thank you. Yeah. What do you want? Five dollars. I ain't got it for you, my boy. Yep. Come on, man. No. She said, look for a black woman. She said, anywhere in the world, a black woman will help you. We tied. Black women that built me up on this platform. <laughs> oh. Hey, y'all. Good morning. Today is Sunday. Uh, we're getting ready to go to church. And... I am running a little bit behind schedule, but like not nothing too crazy, too crazy. And I'm trying to stop like, you know, rushing. Like, I'm gonna get there when I get there and I know that I'm not gonna be there like obnoxiously late. Okay, my hair just does not wanna come out the ponytail. So when it's like that, I'm trying to like slow down and just relax a little, you know, relax. I just wanted to wake up, say good morning to y'all, show y'all my outfit for church because it's real simple. I, I really, truly just found it this morning, honestly. And it's not what I would ideally want to wear today. Like ideally, I would want to wear some type of dress or like a skirt or something like that. But y'all, I haven't washed clothes. <laughs> I have not washed clothes and I won't lie about it. So we're wearing jeans and a t-shirt with like this little trench jacket situation thing from Pretty Little Thing. So um, yeah, that's what we're gonna be wearing. But again, I just wanted to come in and say good morning. Do my skincare with y'all because y'all know, y'all know we gotta get that done regardless. Go ahead, put my hair into two little ponies like I've been doing. I just wanted to kind of brush it back a little bit because I've been rocking like puff balls, quote unquote. Um, I've been rocking puff balls. It's a little rough in there. <laughs> just a little bit. Um, the wig is already styled. Y'all, when I tell you, I'm so glad. I'm so so glad I discovered the fact that I just needed a ceramic iron instead of the uh, one that I've been using. It is literally a game changer. Literally. And I don't, I don't think I've ever seen anybody say anything about it. Like, I don't think I have. But ceramic curls last you a wee bit a wee bit longer that's just my little um observation okay there we go all right hair is done this is um a blush from oh This is from, what's that place called? Yeah, we just, we just, we just did that. We really, <laughs> we really did that one, sister. Oh, we, I mean, oh yeah, she, she did that. Okay. We're just gonna throw on the skin tint now. I mean, I have no primer on my face at all. Oh my gosh. At this point, what can we do now? Just throw a little bit of the milk. Oh, it's so pink. It's so pink, it's so pink, it's so pink. Okay. We're just gonna throw a little Tint, what's it called? Moisturizing tint on. Let's pray. Yeah, that did it. Okay. 
Especially on that nose. How did we get here? Like, <laughs> what was happening? Okay. Hopefully, I don't look too insane. Powder, a little powder under the eye. I can't wear too much makeup to church because baby, I be crying. Crying my little eyes out. Every Sunday. <laughs> Every Sunday, thank you Jesus. It actually doesn't look that bad. Let me finish getting dressed and get my fragrance. I'm gonna show y'all the outfit and we're gonna head out the door. Change of plans for the outfit. We're just gonna stick to the t-shirt and jeans. These are the um, jeans that I got from Fashion Nova a long time ago. I'm wearing my boots because I just did not feel like wearing heels today. And then I'm carrying this big old bag that I have been carrying all week. I think I got this from like Belk maybe two years ago or something when all of the um, Bottega dupes was going viral. So yeah, this is what we're wearing. Um, for fragrance, we're just wearing Donna Born and Roma. This is the regular one. I need to re-up on this real bad, real bad, real bad. But it's almost time for me to pull out my intense Mm. Y'all know that's my stuff. Okay. Hey y'all. What is up? We just left church. We got a good word in. And I feel good. I feel good. And I am ready to start my week. What else I'm gonna say? She's hungry, but I was smart. Not really smart because girl, why did my behind? I was supposed to drink one of my um, protein shakes that I just bought yesterday. I just bought protein shakes for this exact reason. Because when I'm rushing out the door, I need something to like, you know, protein. Like I'm, I'm trying, the thing is, I'm trying to wake up and have protein. That's what I'm supposed to have. You gotta wake up and have 30 grams, okay? <laughs> this is me talking to me. Um, so I was supposed to wake up and make my protein matcha before I went to church but again like I told y'all this morning was running late and that did not end up happening are y'all blurry no y'all are either. okay yes yeah, so that did not end up happening so I don't really know what's going on with my camera right now I think it's too hot <clears throat> to like focus so I'm gonna let it cool off real quick for a second I'm gonna pick y'all right back up we're back back in action so we were gonna go to a fiesta and get some chicharrones, right? Because I really have been wanting a freaking chicharron. Girl, why I just do the math real quick? <laughs> why they say, first of all, I know eight ounces is a pound, but I know they go by half, like uh, half a pound or something like that. Why four ounces of chicharron, which is one, probably, probably, more than likely one uh freaking chicharron is 750 calories oh <laughs> i'm through i am through why everything good everything good we're going to be healthy and we're going home and we're going to eat our ground beef and rice that we got to help i mean granted i was gonna eat that regardless that was just gonna be dinner, you know what I'm saying? But now you telling me I can't even have I can't even have a chicharron because cause cause the chicharron don't want me. We're heading home, making healthy girl decisions. And uh yeah. I guess I'll just see y'all when we get there because my camera keeps overheating in the um on this little mat. And yeah, I don't feel like dealing with that. So I'll see y'all when we get to the crib. Welcome home. We just left my grandmother's house and we just left church. Starving like Marvin. Mm. We're gonna go ahead and heat up my last of the ground beef and rice. <sighs> I think I'm gonna go to the store tonight and get some more ground beef. Or maybe ground chicken. Excuse me, I'm hungry. I, I had to put something in my mouth, okay? I need to eat some. So I'm finna smack on these grapes. Real bad. Change the plans back to the beginning. We're gonna fry us an egg. 
and put it over our ground beef and rice. I didn't show y'all at first, but this is what I meant when I said I pre like put the suya spice and everything on there. This is suya spice and um, cayenne pepper. So I just put this in the microwave for like a, a minute, I was gonna say an hour 30, for a minute and 30 seconds. And then I'm gonna fry egg, put this on top. So we're gonna warm this up, get everything prepared, I'm gonna eat. And then we're gonna go and change and prepare for the gym because I still have to go to the gym today. No! What no what what Edna say? No capes, no skips. <laughs> Million dollar whips and that's a private house. 